Hey guys, I'm Prayak, and today I'm going to be talking about uh, AI helps drone swarms navigate through crowded and familiar places. So let's get this video started. Drone swarms frequently fly outside for a reason. It's difficult for the robot flyers to navigate in tight spaces without hitting each other. Caltech researchers may have a way for those drones to fly indoors. However, they developed a machine learning algorithm. Globe to local safe and to Autonomy synthesis, which stands for GLASS, that lets swarms navigate crowded, unmapped environments. The system works by giving each drone a degree of independence and lets it adapt to, ch to the changing environment instead of applying on an uh, existing map on the roads of every other drone in the swarm. GLASS has a, a, um, each machine learning how to navigate a given space on its own, even as it co uh, coordinates with each other. This uh, decentralized model both helps the drones in improvise and making scale the swarm easier as the computing is spread across many robots. Uh, later, I'll be, I'll be showing you a video about this. An additional tracking controller, Neural Swarm, helps the drones uh, compensate for aerodynamic interactions, such as the uh, down wash from a robot flying overhead. It's already more reliable than a commercial controller that doesn't uh, account for aerodynamics. With far smaller tracking errors, this could be useful for drone lights shows. Of course, but it could also help with more uh, vital operations. Search and rescue drones could safely um, calm areas in packs, while safely driving cars could keep traffic jams and collisions to a minimum. It may uh, take a while before there are implementations outside of, of outside of the lab. But uh, don't be surprised if flokes of drones become uh, relatively uh, commonplace. Now, the video. That's all for today, guys. If you like what you saw, please like, subscribe, and share. Bye.